Studios in Oklahoma City. This is an OSU update with Gina Mizell. I'm Jenny Carlson. Gina, the spring game has come and gone for the Cowboys. And interesting, a couple weeks ago we thought we had clarity on this quarterback battle. Now coming out of the spring game, it seems like it's as up in the air as ever. What's the latest with the quarterback situation? Well, what a difference a year makes. I mean, last year after the spring game, Mike Gundy was so adamant that he wanted to name a starter um, shortly afterwards and like the Wednesday or Thursday. Um, coming up after the spring game was when Wes Lunt was named the starter for the season opener and his reasoning behind that most of all was that he wanted that guy to lead those summer workouts to have the rest of the team follow when they're out there working out and coaches can't be out there helping them so um, it's interesting now that now you've got three guys um, and don't really have that you know named leader to, to do those summer workouts and again it'll be interesting to see who takes over is it Clint Shelf because he is a senior because he is the incumbent now so to speak or do all three of the, these guys kind of control tribute just because they all have had success on the field last year. Yeah. So what is different between this year and last year? Do they just not have a clear-cut guy or do they now have three guys that they've seen produce and they don't know which one to pick? Are they trying to keep guys from transferring? What's changed since last year? It's interesting trying to decipher Mike Gundy's uh, comments like you said uh, about two weeks ago, two, three weeks ago he was saying you know Shelf is our number one guy. I don't really feel like there's a battle to start in that first game and then he kind of retracted or backpedaled a little bit and said, well, we haven't really said anything about the first game. And then after the spring game, he said, we're not going to talk about quarterbacks and they're not going to be made available until after the season opener. So it's, it's very odd and, and kind of bizarre, so to speak. But again, you've got Mississippi State opening up against um, Oklahoma State, and that's certainly not Savannah State or a typical opener for, for a non-conference season. So, and you've got three guys in West Lunt, Clint Shelf, J.W. Walsh, should all kind of play a different style. So, again, maybe he's trying to keep his opponents guessing. He did that a little bit last year when the injuries kind of had things up in the air. Would J.W. Walsh start? Would Wes Lunt start? Would Clint Shelf start? A lot of oars on the depth chart uh, at times last year, and kind of he was pretty tight-lipped about it. So, I think ultimately he's got three guys that can produce. You've got 20 more practices in fall camp. Why make a decision now? But it is certainly uh, interesting just based on uh, how he was so adamant last year to name that guy after spring ball. The intrigue continues. Thanks, Gina. <laughs> Be sure to stay with the best coverage team anywhere at newsok.com and every day in the open. Oh,